It's a song called, these are a few of my favorite things. <laughs> this is one of those? Yeah, right. Okay. So this gets into, you're looking at Clovis points, or a keg notch points, they're so standardly made, you're reacting to consistent shapes. Mm -hmm. No problem. Yeah. But before they got to look like that, somebody had to sit there and chip and chip mm -hmm. and chip. Mm -hmm. um, and the early stages of them don't look like that. But the key to those kinds of technologies is what I call bipolar or anvil smashing technologies, yeah. which are also known in places in the world. Yeah. Um, you have to go by the flake scars. Right. And so this thing has what's called the release face. Yeah. It's smooth. Mm -hmm. uh, that's probably where it was struck. You can make these without a hammer. You can make them with an anvil. Yeah. So th this was part of some large core that someone struck off. Right. But look at all of these flakes that have been detached before that. Mm -hmm. uh, they, these were struck in different areas of the core. So in, in the sense of it being la la la, and I'm not saying this is la la la, but that conjures up the specter of Neanderthals, and that, that's, 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 that's like not where we're kind of words, yeah, yeah, that's not where we're going with it. But, yeah. but, but Neanderthal technology was good at preforming the flakes right. on the core and taking the whole lid off. Yeah. Voila. That's what this thing is. There are um, several tools that have been fashioned on this, yeah. little raver tools. Yeah. So, um, and you can see here from the force lines uh, that it was struck this way. So, mm -hmm. to explain this thing being made by nature with a rock rolling down the hill, uh, it's pretty improbable. Right. It's, uh, you, you it's got, quite a stretch. I right? mean, there's, there's yeah. been propositive work here, yeah. then the whole thing was removed. That's what humans do. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They don't randomly beat on them. Right. So uh, I regard this as a definitive pre -close. I mean, even to buy and practice diet seems obvious. But things are being struck off this quite deliberately. Right. Yeah. We like this because, see, this, the, this still bears the cortex, the chemically weathered surface. You'll see all these boulders when we go out there. I don't care whether you're a glovis person or a woodman. you got to get rid of this. This is worthless mm -hmm. because it's not sharp. What you want is the sharp chirp mm -hmm. plant inside. So somebody has struck this off, um, and then look at the retouch mm -hmm. that they've done. I mean, <laughs> archaic people, mm -hmm. this is not lithic rocket science. Mm -hmm. Everybody in the world needs flakes for tools, mm -hmm. and they cut interfacial bevels on them, mm -hmm. uh, and then you scrape. If you found this on a 5,000 year old site, you say smoke shade interface, Right. You know, type it into the computer. Good so the only thing yeah. prevent, preventing the recognition of that was this is a 50,000 year old sign. Well, this, this is maybe that old, but this is in the upper layer. So, so not, it might not be that old. Oh, yeah. It's still pretty clever. 35,000. Okay. Hey, oh, yeah. Who's counting? Right thing in all the place. <laughs> yeah. Now, this is, yeah. this is good. So, I mean, these, these are typical stone tools.